Uh, what's the sort of one piece of advice you can give our listeners uh, for something that you've learned, something you might do differently, uh, something that you you really sort of live by? And uh, I'm going to start with uh, with you, Andrea. Many things. I would do many things differently. No, but uh, I think uh, if there is one thing um, that I think made a huge difference uh, uh, has been to co-create together with the business, get uh, this uh, level of collaboration high early on in the journey instead of, uh, you know, having it uh, having it later. I think uh, Anna Maria also mentioned uh, this uh, as an aspect, uh, creating the, the, uh, the you know, the... Um, the real partnership relationship is very different from the sort of like client server um, uh, relationship and doing it um, very much uh, early on at the beginning. So design the organization, having this collaboration layout in mind and, uh, um, and enforce it by essentially making it um, um, also um, an expectation, right, that every data project uh, has business champions or anyway, business partners directly involved in the project and iteratively uh, interacting uh, uh, with it. I think there is one thing, this is what probably I would do, I would do now. <laughs> I don't know if I would say I would change it, but I think changing culture is very difficult. And it takes a very long time. So I think patience and persistence. Don't give up. It's like, you know, you start going to the gym, you won't see a difference for a year, but then once you see it, you see it. And then you just keep going. So I think the advice that I give to myself and everybody else, just keep doing it. Patient, slow pace, keep moving. You you will see benefits from it. Yeah, my, I, I would... I'm similar um, in that I would spend more time um, just building the relationships up front, thinking less about the cool data stuff that we could provide and the cool technical things that we could build uh, and spend more time um, with the with the partners, right? Spend more time understanding their needs even if what they need is not that exciting for us to produce, uh, it still is valuable to, to do it uh, anyway. And then also starting smaller. Uh, it's very, very hard to try to get an entire organization to to change at once. And so probably would have started just getting smaller wins under the belt um, mm-hmm. before trying to tackle the entire thing. Yeah, that's great advice. Um, I live that one too at Yahoo. Uh, just getting um, getting something small and getting success that feeds upon itself and allows you to do bigger things. But trying to boil the ocean is uh, is a recipe for disaster. Uh, 